My name is Jeffrey Middleton, and I'm living with Mertinella disease. My symptoms started in September 2015. I was 29 years old when I was diagnosed, and I used to run a lot of marathons and hard marathons, and now I'm not able to do any of that. At the moment, I'm in the place of my walking and my talking, um, as you can probably tell. And now I have to use a big military aid to get around and walk, um, or sometimes even a wheelchair. In the future, I'm in the potentially affect the use of my arms and my hands so I might not be able to use them because the condition will ultimately paralyze my body um, and it will affect my breathing. Motor neuron disease is a neurodegenerative disease of the motor system. The connection between the brain and the muscles breaks down and the nerves die. The disease is progressive and eventually patients become paralysed, have problems breathing and eventually after two to three years uh, they succumb to the illness and die. Unfortunately there is no curative treatment for motor neuron disease. Therefore the mainstay of treatment is supportive care. In motor neuron disease a typical drug trial will cost many millions of pounds and takes 18 months of follow-up in a patient. One of the advantages of using techniques such as MRI PET is that we will not need to wait for 18 months following up individual patients because we'll be able to see much earlier by looking directly at the functional chemistry in the brain and seeing if the drug is working. This will mean we can test many more drugs so we'll hopefully be able to advance treatments of these conditions very quickly.